Hey guys, welcome and welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're here for the first time, if you're stopping by for the first time, welcome. Okay, and for my returning subscribers, you guys are the best. Thank you so so much for tuning in. Welcome back to my channel. Okay, and please, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button. Okay, just touch it, hit on it. It's just very very simple. It doesn't cost a thing. Hit on that subscribe button, subscribe to my channel, and turn your notification bell on so you'll be notified each time I post a new video. So guys, this is what I'm up to today. You guys can see me feeling myself. Ah, ah, ah. <laughs> so I just wanted to be a bit dramatic or will I say creative? I don't know. I don't know. But I just wanted to try out something different on my hair. And since I am not on natural hair right now, I decided to do it with my podo puff. So let's get to it. Hey loves and welcome back. So for the start, I'm just going to pack my hair up as you guys can see, like put it into a high bone, very high. Um, would like to say not at the back, but very close, almost very close to my face, to my forehead. Yeah, as you guys can see. And then I scattered the bone before packing it. I scattered it very well so it won't be small. Okay. And then I removed some strands just basically how, how many you want to put your beads i'm just going to i remove like um like 10 strands five the uh, on the right side and five on the left side and then i started losing the hair i had to scatter this hair i had to like it's not like scattering but i just had to remove those knots on um at the tip yeah remove the knot for the bead to actually enter and as you guys can see what i'm doing i'm just trying to use my my bridal pin you guys know this pin to um work my my beats in so depending on how dramatic i don't know why i'm saying that this is dramatic but depending on how um how you want the look to be if you want it to be very like very very that that beats let me just say if you want the beats to be much fine then you can you can maybe use like two beads on each strand or you can mix the beads you can use small beads and um these big ones basically anyhow you want to do this but this is the beads available now like i have small beads very very small so they can actually enter like pass through that hair strand so i had to use just these big ones okay maybe when i get smaller beads if i'm still on this hairstyle i might just try it out okay like try uh, any other type of bead out okay so as you guys can see i'm just con going to do this to all the um strands that i removed yeah basically that and then i'll tie it to make sure that it doesn't when i shake my hair or something you know it's not just going to fall out okay that is it empty hearts and neon lights the playing with my mind gotta get out of here tonight oh i wanna run off i am fly i just wanted to tell you that you can actually beat every butterfly logs or every crochet because some of them are hard and some of them are actually um strong will i say um big yeah like some of them are big from the tip of the hair to the root okay so you can beat all of them my own is puddle puff and it's super soft that's why i can be able to beat it so this is me doing shakara when i'm not even done with beating the hair i don't know i own just too much finally we've gotten to the very last strand and i am done and this is the beauty ah, ah, this is what i curated this is this is the drama Ooh, tell me that girl without a drama who is that it can't be me it definitely cannot be me okay you guys i love it i love 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 it i took a lot of pictures i took um i, I did videos i actually <laughs> flexed the hair and I, I had to lose the hair the next day because i needed my hair for something like i needed this for another video so i had to remove the bits but i'm going to put it because I, I really like it i really like the drama it's giving me okay so basically you can do everything you want if you want it to be in front if you want it to be at the side you guys can see what i was about to do there i just used um because i don't have black trade and this is going to be firmer than a black sorry a black rubber 
yeah so i basically use my use one of the strand of the hair the longer ones like the ones that are long to just hold it if i want to shift it back i want to shift it front basically anyhow i want it to be so this is it this is the look you guys uh -uh. is there something so beautiful like there's something so cute about this natural beauty something ah it is doing me somehow for body it just did it just did in it in me i mean just take a look at me take a close look at me zoom your screen see beauty see smile see hair i just said uh, like i'm okay okay <laughs> so you guys i really 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 love it okay i just love it and you see that drama you see it you see it ah that's that's the best part of it i can shake the hair from today to tomorrow <laughs> so like i said you can keep it at anywhere you want it to be at the right hand side left hand side in front of the hair as a baby face something like that i think you can just be creative with it just anyhow you want so I actually thought of spicing things up, like just spicing, just small spice, a little bit of it, small. And I thought of using my my scarf to do this. I looked for a scarf that will match my clothes. I didn't see. I don't know whether this matches very well. You guys should tell me if it's fine. But I I really like black and white. I love it. Maybe I didn't see that anywhere around me. So I had to use this one, but it's actually okay. I like it a little bit, but I will still prefer black color yeah so i just um tied it and then i tucked it in very well and then you can actually draw it very down below like very very close or at your um eyebrows like at the same level with your eyebrows or you can draw it or basically anyhow you want it to be and then you go ahead to tuck the um remaining strands of the hair at the back tuck it in very very well and this is it when this beauty they do me shesha berry <laughs> i like it like i told you guys you can draw it down you can draw it up any how you want it to be it's going to come out just fine you can add much beads you can do anything just be creative just spice things up okay so one of the things i will not get tired of is shaking this hair shake it shake it very well <laughs> i think one of the reasons why i like this um um beats is because i'm going to shake them and they're going to knock together and make sounds i don't know why i feel that way but i really like it so i just had to remove it remove the um scarf again and feel myself a little bit so love that is it for today's video so if this video was helpful it's for if it was interesting if you really liked it if you really like this style please don't forget to give me a thumbs up comment like share all the good stuffs okay and please if you haven't subscribed to my channel please just hit on that subscribe button subscribe to my channel you guys you're almost at 400 subs we are almost there and i am happy and i am grateful to you guys thank you so much for everything please if you haven't subscribed do it hit on that subscribe button it doesn't really cost anything i love you guys so much i love you guys so so much and i appreciate everything you guys are doing for me okay i love you thank you and i will see you in my next one bye